Hey guys, welcome back. I'm going to pan across and show you my bookshelves. Now, I'm not 100% done. I've got a couple empty spaces there that I had, haven't done anything with. I'll pull in closer in a minute to show you what I did. But welcome to um, a collab. Host. This collab is hosted by myself and Bum B. DIY. I'm going to have her channel listed below. And I'm also going to link the playlist below. Because uh, I want you guys to go through and watch all of the... Uh, videos that people are going to be adding to the playlist this is going to be so interesting and so many good ideas we can get from this playlist i'm sure for fall now i pulled back my table and i decided i was going to do a couple months ago i thought you know what maybe i'll try that farmhouse thing because i started liking so many pieces from it and i said but i'm going to put my own twist on it and i'm just going to try it out and and i purchased everything from thrift stores or I did get a couple pieces from the 80% off and the 90% off um, sale at Hobby Lobby. So I don't have much money invested here. And if next week all of this color is driving me bananas, I could take it down. And I can go donate it and it's not going to kill me. So, um, like I said, I'm going to link the playlist below. And I'm going to go through this bookshelf real quick and I'm not going to keep you guys long i'm just going to show you the little bit i did the tablescape for this after i push the table back because you know the table kind of goes up against the uh, bookshelf here and um so you really don't see that bottom see that bottom shelf i did nothing to that that's storage you don't see that when the table's pushed back so that bottom shelf i did nothing to that i just added a couple things on the top shelves and i'll go over it with you so um let me get this real quick let me do this video real quick and that way i'm not keeping you guys okay i'm going to show you look at reggie's little son there remember i had to pick him up and bring him home so i wouldn't pay child support child and then i added a little bit of flour back there just you know to bring in a little fall that's a tear tray and actually these are it's a cake stand underneath with the leaves and a tear tray and again storage i use this for storage the, the you know lower shelves normally i just use them to kind of store things because I'm in a small space. Now this here, again, I don't pull in a lot of pumpkins and ghosts and goblins and all that stuff. I really don't. So I got this little pumpkin from a thrift store a couple weeks ago. And I got that tea, uh, teapot and uh, sugar and creamer at the same time. And I, um, you know, just pulled in a few pieces of fall. Um, this is a William Sonoma. I thrifted this, a William Sonoma terrine. Because for me, fall is soups and, you know, stuff like that. So I pulled that in. It's all white. I didn't want to put, I have one that's a pumpkin, but I didn't want so much color saturation, you know, on this shelf. Then I pull in the black for grounding with my, I got another dog it's in the, on the, um, I can't even talk y'all, on the same spot on the other side of the bookcase, kind of pulling it together. And then I just added things, y'all. This is so not me with all of this stuff and colors. and But you know what? I'm not even mad at this, guys. I'm really not. Here's my little salt and pepper shakers I got with the teapot and the sugar and creamer, too. And I still left in a little glam back there with some gold stuff that I had on. And this right here I can use to store my um, napkin rings that I'm using for the fall and things like, you know, pieces that I use to set the table. And then look up top as Rudy and then we didn't name them I still haven't named those little wooden ones and then look at Reggie in all his glory y'all let me give y'all good look at Reggie Reggie is too much now wait till you see Big Red Big Red is get ready get jacked up Rudy get ready uh, Reggie's get ready get him look he perked up on a uh, little pedestal trying to be as tall as Reggie and then uh, I put that little piece there. I wanted to put, eventually put herbs in there, but for right now, I just have it sitting there. And then I come down on this side and I just got a, all my salt and pepper shake. Not all, but some of them that I wanted that I thought was farmhousey and, you know, that vegetable harvest feel. I put there and um, there's the other dog. Look at my little carrot teapot. And I pulled in some sunflowers again. Fall, look. Reggie's other babies. Reggie cannot stop laying seeds, y'all. Then Martha found him some uh, some of his children in Ohio and sent them to me. Look at my little owl. And then, look, Martha said, she said, Reggie, round here, dropping babies round here, too. 
So she mailed them out to me. Thank you, Martha. I got my little salad bowl that I still like out. Again, harvesty is what I was feeling. That tray I got uh, thrifted not long ago. Look at the duck. I got him for 90% off. I think he was $2. Um, at, or $2.50 at Hobby Lobby, 90% off. And that uh, little um, lantern thing. Let's see, like I said, the bottom, just storage. Just storage. And then here. In the middle shelf again tear tray to store i got a bunch of tear trays and so i run out of space and i try to store them in the bottom of here and then remember the cloche that i got i thrifted that a couple weeks ago and that little tray i got from hobby lobby just sitting there and then i still had to leave some of my um you know glam stuff out some of my clear crystal to break up some of this color guys this color was driving me nuts and again again just stuff collected stuff salt and pepper shakers and my rooster teapot just some pieces look at my, here's another piece of halloween i mean a fall <laughs> pumpkin a pumpkin and i got some dollar tree lights in him the orange lights lit up and uh another teapot again like i said so so again nothing major guys but and i don't do that whole goblin and ghost and all of that kind of stuff like halloween stuff or a bunch a whole bunch of pumpkins and call i don't do a lot of that i just added some in in my bookshelf and i'm gonna leave this probably till thanksgiving and call it a day and then i will change up and go christmas with it and do maybe some i'm thinking nutcracker theme this year so i hope you guys enjoy and i will talk to you later don't forget to go below and hit and check out bumby's channel she has a good channel everybody knows bumby diy she does a diy's 99 cent store dollar hauls um crafts all kinds of stuff she does and um jewelry she's starting to do jewelry jars too so just about everything and um i'm also going to list the playlist so there will be a lot of videos in this uh playlist so guys go get yourself some ideas and um i will talk to you soon i'm probably going to go live tonight so get, get your snacks so we can have a party okay guys thank you so much for joining me i will talk to you soon bye